can big data change the way you do business? I'm Butch Stearns of the Pulse Network, Michelle Getz, Senior Analyst for Forrester Research. So Michelle, how has data changed and the importance for business today? Data isn't just something that you collect and store anymore. It's now your currency. By treating data as currency, you have the opportunity to expand on new business models, expand into new markets, expand into new types of services and products, and you've now become an innovator. So you're really moving from being a data collector to a data investor to a data innovator, and then a business innovator. So how should organizations think about our data platforms to harness the power of this data? One, optimizing around processes and the way that you engage with the business, understanding business strategy and the capabilities that they're looking for. You're looking for ways to source out to a variety of different data sources, maybe not even just in your warehouses. You're wrapping it with contextual services to understand patterns within the data, to gain insight and put it within context of your business. You're thinking about extreme processing to get that insight out as fast as possible to the business so that they can move forward. And lastly, you're thinking about how easily and how elastic and how you can scale to where that information needs to be delivered. So we're now thinking differently about the volume of data we have, the variety of data we have, the velocity of how we're using it. How do we manage all of this? You manage it in probably a way that seems counterintuitive, data governance. When you're looking into the world of big data and into areas where it's external and you don't own that, that data or that information, that's a highly chaotic state. How do you trust it? How can you make sense of that? You have to also think about the fact of how do you validate anything that you're seeing in this chaotic state so that you can move it into a controlled environment, get value out of it. And creating a governance framework, a data governance framework that accounts for each one of these states and then using a hyper-flexible platform that scales in and out to manage these different states is really where businesses need to be thinking. So don't be afraid of data governance anymore. So as an organization, how do I now make the case for big data and big data investment? The business has already made the case. The strategy is there. They're demanding these, cap these business capabilities that will rely on data to move that business forward. If you're staying in line with the business, you have a business case. So at the end of the day, we're not talking about developing an IT strategy, we're just talking about developing a business strategy. To learn more, go to this link, bit.ly slash BDIG Twitter. There you can register today for IBM's Big Data Integration and Governance Forums for 2013.